If you are facing Windows booting issues like automatic repair loop, startup repair loop, recovery screen, then just watch this video and apply some effective methods to fix these issues. So without further ado, let's start the video. At first, let's see how to go to the advanced options or repair mode. Just press and hold the shift key and then click on restart. Okay, next click on troubleshoot and advanced options. Hope you find all the advanced options. Now let's jump to the first method. Here you have to click on start repair option. After then it will diagnose your PC automatically. Now you have to click on shutdown and see what happens. If it not works then apply the second method here you can click on command front now just type the commands and press enter key every time Okay, now click on continue. If you face any black or blue screen issues in your windows, then you can try this 4DDIZ Windows Boot Genius tool to fix these issues. I have given this link in the description box, kindly check it out. Okay, in the third method, you can click on system restore. Here I have no any restore point. If you have already created any restore point, then you can apply this method. Just you have to follow the screen instructions and finally you need to click on restart to fix this issue. Okay, in the next method, you have to click on startup settings. Next click on restart. Now press F4 to open your save mode option. Okay, now here you can see the save mode. Now just search for disk cleanup and open this app. Check mark all the options from here and click on clean up system files. then ok next click on delete files after completing this method just restart your pc and see what happens In the next method, you can reset your PC. To do that, just click on reset this PC and here you can choose keep my files. Then click on local reinstall. Next click on reset. And this method is 100% safe for your files. So don't worry about your important files. Okay, in the last method, you can uninstall the updates. Just click on uninstall updates. And here you have to uninstall from both options. Now click on close. After then click on continue. 
if you are still facing any issues kindly comment below hope you enjoy this video if you get help please like this video and hit the subscribe button for more updates